guys and welcome back to another video and today we're going to be doing a new series on the channel it's going to be called how to youtube where i show you tutorials on how to do different things for your channel like how to edit your videos how to make intros how to make thumbnails so you can find this all in this new series so i hope you enjoy hello guys so we're going to be doing our first episode of how to youtube and the app that we're going to be using to make our intro is going to be called Cute Cut. So there it is right there. So if I click it like so, we're going to be brought up to a page like this. So this is basically how I make my intros, which is pretty cool. So let's just let that finish. Like so. La, 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 la. Here we are. So we're just going to see here there is a plus sign right there so what you want to do is you want to click this well to the tutorial I'm going to be showing you is how I made my intro but you can make your own intro however you want it so we're just going to title this YouTube intro so let's first create we just keep everything the same, all the settings the same. And we press done. And then here we are. So the first thing we want to do, well, what I want to do is so uh, add some music. So let's just look for some music here. Um, do I have some music? Let's just look. Um. Okay, well I'll be right back when I have some music for you. Okay, so we're back and the music I chose is called On The Go. It's one of QCut's music choices. So what you wanna do is you wanna click the music and you have this little dot right here. So you're just gonna drag it all the way, see, um, all the way to 10 seconds because we want our intro to be 10 seconds long, like so. So we just bring that back to the beginning. And what you want to do is you want to find a background for your intro. So we're just going to hop onto Google right now. So here we are on Google. And let's just say that my background, I want it to be a Minecraft theme. So what you would put is, you would just type in Minecraft background. So like so, and then we'll just let that load we go into images and let's just say um i really like this background which is pretty cool so let's just uh, let that focus a little but actually let me choose a different background let's just say that you wanted this one this one looks pretty cool so what you want to do is you just hold down and then you see this save image copy and this video works for iphone ipad stuff like that only apple devices i think because i'm not sure if qcut is actually on other devices like samsung and lg so you just have to check that out so let's go on to save image that should be saved and we just want to look for some other items that we want in our intro so let's just say um we wanted um, like maybe a Minecraft diamond, but you can't just type in Minecraft diamond into the search bar because this is why. So if you type in Minecraft diamond into the Google search, there will be a white background behind you or like some kind of background. So you want it to be transparent. So what you would put is Minecraft diamond and then what you would put after it is PNG. And as you can see, I accidentally spelled Minecraft wrong. I forgot the E. That's okay. So let's just select this one, Minecraft Diamond PNG. And there is a bunch popping up. But you might think like, Panda Wizard, why are you doing PNG if it just looks exactly the same? And here is why. So if you click this, there's like a little checkerboard background. So if you save it and you add it into your intro, it will be transparent. 
Okay, let's hold. Ah, there's one. In. Okay, let's do this one. Then. Okay, hold down, and this one we can save. And for the very center of our intro, let's just say that we wanted Minecraft Steve. And what we would also do is add PNG at the end of the search. So we just select that, like so. <laughs> and let's just say we really liked, there's some really weird Steve's on here. <laughs> let's just say we like this one. So see it has a checkerboard background. Then we would select it, like so. And we'll just go back onto CubeCut now. Okay, so we're back on CubeCut. See, we still have the music on the go. Link to 10 seconds. So what we would do is, okay, let's press photo. Yes, we want CubeCut to access our photos. So what we have is this Minecraft background. So here it is right there, as you can see. And you want to drag this all the way to 10 seconds okay and then you want to press the little check mark on the bottom when you're done just drag this blue all the way to the beginning and then we want to add our steve in the middle so what we would do is we would just drag this steve all the way here like so okay that looks good See, there's our Steve right there. Okay, let's just um, drag this to the beginning. Uh, it's not working, but who cares? Okay, so this looks pretty good. And what you can do is you have the option to move the Steve if you would like. So I'm just gonna make this a little smaller, like that. Let's just press the check. And you can see my face, hi! <laughs> This is me. Yes, <laughs> that was weird. Okay, now we want to add our Minecraft diamonds in the corners here. So you just want to add some. There's Stampy right there. <laughs> okay. So what we would do is we would drag this all the way to 10 seconds. Like so. There it is. The diamond. Okay. Okay, now what we want to do is we want to move this diamond all the way, all the way, I say, into the corner. So that looks good. Whoa, what just happened? Yeah, there it is. Okay, so we're just going to repeat the process for all of these diamonds. So you just want to um, keep adding three, you just want to add three more diamonds, put them all in the corners, and then I will show you the rest. So we've added all of our diamonds, like so. <clears throat> so we added all these four diamonds, and we put them all in the corners. So you might be wondering, how do you make them spin and stuff? How do you make that grow out? So I will show you. And the first thing you want to do is click, click the sleeve. And there are these options in the bottom of the iPad. So what you would click is this little magic wand thing. And you would just press add, like so. And what I would choose for this is grow out. So this is good, like so. But we don't want that to be all the way um, in the intro So let's just do this And what you would do is you see this little triangle right here. You would just drag it like this Okay, it's dragging And you would just put it like halfway into Like that Okay This is good and now let's see what it actually looks like. Okay, let's just press the check. And let's watch what we've done so far. 
Okay, so that looks pretty good. Wait, no, actually, that's kind of big. So, I'm actually gonna... No! <laughs> Let's just put that back. Um, uh, we just wanna change that transition because I forgot which one I chose. It might have been grow in and grow out, but. Okay, let's check that. So let's just press play. Okay, so you see it going like that. Just keep going. And then it grows out. So that's pretty good. And let's just press it back. Just press the check. Okay, now we want to do the spinning diamond. So here it is. You just press um, this magic wand like this. Press the plus button and you want to press custom transition. And what you do is you press this rotate button. So you just keep clicking it rapidly, just nonstop. And when you feel like you've done it so much that the, that the app just can't even take it anymore, you can take your finger off of the rotate button. And then you'll just repeat the process for all of the diamonds. So I will just be right back when I complete all of it. And this is what we have so far. So let me just play the clip. Okay, so here we have our spinning diamonds. Woo! Okay, so that looks pretty cool, and then the Steve grows up. But you, okay, so this looks pretty good. So I think this will be the end of um, this how-to, but before I leave, let me show you how you save it and how you add it into your videos. So you would just press this, just press export to album, High quality, you always want to keep it a high quality. There, the movie is exporting. Okay, it's going pretty fast. And we're gonna be exiting out of the app when this is done. So the export has completed. So we're just gonna exit out. And we're going to be going into iMovie. So this is where I do all my editing. I will do a more brief process, maybe in the next episode or so. So let's just see, we have a clip of me going to Six Flags. Like, so what you would do is you can, so here we have our thing and you can just add it in. So here, this is what it looks like. The intro going right there into the video. So there it's going and then the tape grows out of you. And then we have the video starting. So this will be the end of the first episode of How To YouTube. So stay tuned for the next one where I will show you more tutorials. So bye.